File Overview The Foundation is not the only group with an interest and investment in the paranormal and metaphysical. There are many other groups in existence who possess, use, or attempt to create SCP objects, either for their own personal gain or for the protection of mankind. Some are rival organizations, some are splinter groups of the Foundation, and some are trusted associates of the Foundation. In any case, it has been deemed necessary to create and distribute a brief on what agencies the Foundation knows about and our stance towards them. The Davites Overview The information contained within this file cannot be authenticated with 100% certainty due to the anomalous nature of content. As with all atemporal retrocausal anomalies, a healthy skepticism is recommended when discussing or researching the information on the devas. If in reviewing this file you notice inaccuracies or discrepancies with baseline reality, please report to your on-site Reza representative. Maria Jones, Director, Reza. Dear College Overview Dear College is a co-educational liberal arts and occult sciences college in the heart of scenic Three Portlands, an extra-dimensional city-state located adjacent to the American Northwest and Southern England, with a curriculum that focuses on the merit of mundane and occult disciplines, and a well-regarded and art program. Deer is often seen as the liberal arts counterpart to its GOC-sponsored rival across town, ICSUT Portland's. A number of prominent figures in the anomalous world are Deer alumni, including Vincent Anderson, the CEO of Anderson Robotics, and Esther Lesbian Gangar Kogan, one of the co-founders of Gamers Against Weed. As the Foundation's operations in Three Portlands are heavily restricted by a number of agreements with the FBI's Unusual Incidents Unit, Deer College itself is relatively free of Foundation intervention. However, all Deer alumni are automatically marked as persons of interest and may be subject to increased Foundation scrutiny. Dr. Wondertainment Overview Dr. Wondertainment whether an individual or collective entity is capable of producing anomalous artifacts and entities which thematically resemble children's toys. The nature of these objects and devices varies, although all were clearly intended to be utilized by children. In addition, Dr. Wondertainment is responsible for the creation of the Little Misters, anomalous humanoids altered for collectability. Dr. Wondertainment is known to have targeted Foundation personnel in the past, and their feelings toward the Foundation appear to be ambiguous. See the entry for Isabel Wondertainment on the personnel dossier for more information. Links to the factory have been speculated, but are unconfirmed. The Factory Overview Little is known about the factory. Excursions into facilities purported to be operated by them have yielded limited results and no concrete conclusions have been reached except that they seem capable of manufacturing anomalous artifacts and that they use mass production techniques to do so. The Fifth Church This church is to other churches what clowns are to people. There are some superficial similarities, but all the wrong things are being emphasized and exaggerated, so you can't quite put your finger on what is wrong. Sure, it isn't out to get you, but what does it mean? Why is it there? What happens if it calls to you? Dr. Overview The Fifth Church, also known as the Church of Fifthism, or the Fifthist Fellowship, is a highly secretive religious organization which possesses ties throughout the entertainment industry. Despite repeated investigations, culminating in the 2007 nationwide sting known as Operation Stargazer, no further details regarding its doctrines, its practices, its number of members, or its goals have been confirmed, although a watch list is maintained of 100 confirmed and suspected 50 celebrities and other prominent personalities. Its origins have been placed in varying points in the mid-20th century and various locations in North America and Asia, but some sources have dated it to centuries earlier. The Fifth Church has never communicated directly with the SCP Foundation, but is to be considered a hostile force. End of file. To learn more about the SCP Foundation, subscribe to SCP Orientation Today and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss any of our videos.